At first glance, I thought Cozy Grove was a don't starve like, but with a happy spin on it. Aesthetically, when you look at the videos, of the the trailers and everything, it really does kind of look like like a, like a happy don't starve. You know, everything's white and bright and colorful and everything. And I thought this might be this this might be something I can get into. And as I play it. I very quickly run out of things to do until the next day, the next literal IRL day. I can't do anything until I wait. So this is day four and I'm gonna record this now because I'm done waiting for the next day to make a recording, for the next day to make a recording. We're gonna do it right now so I can show you guys what's up. It is very much like, uh, like Animal Crossing in that respect where, you know, you only have uh, so many Things you can do in a certain in a certain day. So here's your character. Uh, she's adorable. You can you can customize your character however you want, uh, and she is like a, kind of like a, a scout of some sort, a uh, spirit scout. And so you find yourself on this island. You're stranded because your raft basically floated away, uh, and you are talking to all of the local ghosts and everything and trying to help them uh, just progress their own story. Uh, so today what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go through the game loop. Of content uh, of like of like actual progressive content and show you how that works this little guy right here flamey he basically uh, eats these soul logs then he'll, t then he'll basically help progress the story overall um, but you have to collect them by doing uh, chores and tasks for these people so uh, these these ghosts here uh, once you're done, these areas are going to be like nice and colorful and they're going to have plenty of, uh, uh, of things you can interact with and all that. And then you could get down to the crafting, you could get down to uh, collecting and, and gathering items across the islands and everything. Uh, and then the next day you come back and then you'll be able to do these quests again to further progress the story. They say there's 40 hours of content designed to last you months because of the time gating thing, which is an immediate turnoff for some of you folks. I totally get it because, again, I was thinking... Don't starve. Get in. You know, beat my head against the wall for a little bit. Have a lot of fun. And then I'm done. Four hours later. But no. <laughs> but no. Four days later. Okay. So this is kind of help you with something. It says you're well on your way to becoming completely oriented, scouts. I hear you've been helping out other ghosts on the island. Yeah. That's a nice thing for a spirit scout to do. I guess I'm still in the tutorial. Half a week later. Hey, since you're out there searching for missing things. Oh, you haven't seen my tea mug. Tea mug, have you? Oh, okay. So we got to find the tea mug. All right. So he wants a tea mug. No problem. Let's go ahead and skedaddle over here. You can pick up certain things like this uh, it's a donut. Oh, it's a tea pastry. Oh. Uh, let me see. Who needs a tea pastry? Oh, you know what? That, that bird likes tea pastries. You might give me a harvest. So all of this garbage right here I crafted and put here because this bird is just a fan of all this stuff. And so the more that you do it, the higher his heart gets, higher his heart count gets. Three hearts gives you lots of essence. Um, well, he wants specifically that kind of donut, but I wonder if, let me pet him real quick. My bad. I meant to get, let me get back a little bit. There we go. So we'll put this in my hand, hold in hand. And then if I go talk to him to see, will he take this? Nope. Okay. Okay. Well, we, we tried, we tried. Every once in a while, he'll drop some essence, and you can use that to craft, apparently. I have not yet crafted anything that requires it, so... Oops. So I'm not sure about that. All these little ghosts right here, they disappear every time you get close. I've not yet figured out how to communicate with them. The ill wind is back! I've been stuffing feathers in my coat all morning to no avail! If I can get a warmth from some quarter soon, uh, I'll, I'll be able to... Uh, you know, dramatic see your posture. Okay, so squawk! I wonder if he could help. Okay. Who? Why the merchant of mischief, trickster, terra firma, my constant tormentor, Mr. Kit. Some say he sells wares. Uh, you can count the shivers, but perhaps there's just a fisherman's tale. Okay, maybe they're just fisherman's tale tales. Maybe not. So yeah, each day they give you something to do. And it's different. I mean, it's it's, it's progressing. You're progressing. Oh, so you're progressing a story, so it's different every day. Okay, let's see what kind of hello again, maker buddy. I've been thinking about you stuck here in Cozy Grove. You and I, sort of the same pickle bear, aren't we? Um, let's see. You, <laughs> I'm not quite sure. You can make selections, like dialogue selections, like this, but they don't really seem to have a uh, uh, like any kind of purpose necessarily. Um, stick to woodwork. I made him feel. Oh, I made him feel awkward now. So all I mean is, neither one of us quite knows what we're doing here, do we? But I can help you dig a little deeper into this mystery. With five branches and one piece of softwood, I think I could do just that. I think I actually already have that. Yeah, I sure do. Well, look at that. Mission accomplished. Because I, I, 
yesterday when I was playing, I was just like, well, I guess if I'm out of stuff to do, I'll just run around and collect a bunch of crap. And I did, so I, I got some got some pretty good resources, made a whole bunch of items and everything. So I found everything. That's great. I was worried. I asked too much of you. Here you go. Your very first pickaxe. Hey, hey. It's a little flimsy, but it should do right. Okay, cool. So here we go. We got pickaxe. Uh, let me see. Doom Hunters plays well. Wouldn't mind knowing is all. We don't know why we're all stuck here. It's one of life's big mysteries. Boop. So he's going to give me that. And then you're going to see the story advance. And then the color comes back. Ooh. And then coins drop. And then you run around. And you collect all these little coins. Collect them all. They could not be conveniently located in one spot. They got to scatter them all over the place. So you find them later on like that. Okay. Is that everything? I think so. All right. I only have one heart with that dude. Jeez. Do you want a donut? Hey, kid, you want a donut? <laughs> oh, feathers. I gotta collect these, too. So, yeah, some of these guys are asking for different things, right? Like some of these little ghost spirits. And I, again, I've not figured out how to uh, help them with that. I've tried holding it in my hand and, like, sneak over to them. I tried dropping it where they spawn, the item they're asking for. And none of it seems to work. So, I'm not quite sure how to do that yet. It's something maybe will come on day six. Uh, let's see. I want you to go mailbox. Well, I guess I'm on the mailbox, I guess. Let me see. Uh, it's, it's, who's this from? Scoutmaster Blake. So I'm not I'm not the sort to become alarmed, but we found bits of a little boat wrecked on the shore. It looked a lot like your boat. Haha, <laughs> adventure. Am I right? Don't worry. If you are lost for too long, we'll come to get you. Almost oh, certainly. All right. <laughs> they found my boat and they're just like, well, you know, if you don't show up for a while. Oh, here we go. Bird's going to love this. So let's go and get all the presents out of these gifts. There we go. And let's go and talk to him see if we help him with something. So, all right. Heads up, postal helper. Looks like another po postmark, past mark delivery incoming. When you're alive, letters arrive at the post office a few days after they're sent. But ghost letters, they don't run on regular time. And they're likely to show up at non-standard addresses. Like in leaf piles or behind rocks. So, if you find any letters in there, please bring them. Okay. So, we gotta look for leaf piles and rocks. There's been no shortage of things to do in the game, right? Like, that's not a complaint. Is this something I pick up? No. Um, the game definitely gives you, uh, in terms of, like, assortment, I should say. Like, a variety of things. But most of them pretty much entail, like, go and dig around until you find blank or dig around until you find blank, right? Uh, but it's always something different. And you get you get different stuff out of it. Like, like I, got, I got, like, a huge log out of that pile of leaves. <laughs> And it's it's the uh, it's the time gated gatedness of the story that um, people have the biggest problem with. Uh, for me, like there's definitely some like boneheaded like inventory things that uh, I feel like they're trying to be like like the worst parts of of uh, 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 Animal Crossing, which is the way that the inventory fills up super fast, <laughs> like super fast. Let me see. So common. Okay, I could go ahead and you see. Okay, I could go ahead and place this here. Let me see, place it here. We might as well put it down somewhere. Get it out of my bag. Ooh. Okay, yeah, place it there. Oh, she's stuck. Oh, I had two of them. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. Now I can actually spread the light here if I were to make a. Do I have a lamp? I do have a lamp post. Perfect. So I can actually uh, place this. Over here, and it'll extend that light out further. Like, repeat, see? Kind of repeats the light here. So, put that here. Plus light. There we go. So, we kind of extend this out. Now, let me go and put that, uh, the donut. The oh, bagel, that's what he wants. Okay, bagel. And now, I'll go talk to this bird. Feed! Look at that. And then, what does it do? Does it give me, it gives you essences, right? This is my first full day having this bird. He's shiny. Harvest. There's gonna be lots of essence because three hearts. One. What? Oh, was it four? No, I already had a few. Hold on a second. Bird. Oh man, he's not gonna eat anymore. Okay, well, fine. You on break, bud? Declan's here. Okay, well, you're in class, aren't you? You better go. Oh, as my son just said, hug someone in your family. Hug someone in your family? Yeah. Boy, give me a hug. Oh, give me a squeeze. Ah, oh, that was a good one. All right. Have a good day. <laughs> uh, that was 
good hug. <laughs> See, the game, the game is cozy. Got the real life thing and the cozy boy and everything. It's just, it's, this is good. It's just a kickback. Uh, all right, here we go. So uh, what would you like to do? Um, get in hidden object directions. Ooh, okay. Well, hold on a second. Review the Black Book of Ghost Mementos uh, about that. Let me see. Still searching? Yeah, oh, sorry. The mug. I got the mug. Hold on. I got it in my bag. I put it in my hand. There we go. Uh, hold on. There we go. No? What? What the? I don't mean to get directions. Bro, I'm holding the thing that you want in my hand. Oh, so you're gonna sell me a hint? No. What are you gonna sell me a hint? What the heck? Review the Black Book of Ghost Mementos? No, this is yeah, this is all that when you when you unlock story things, you get these memories that pop up. It's cute. Uh, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> um, boy, I guess I guess he doesn't want this thing. That's really weird. Okay, well we'll just go somewhere else then. Screw you. We'll go take care of other folks. We'll go to the shop here. I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna sell this stuff. I want to buy clothes. Oh, I guess it's part of my. Oh, okay. Yeah, it must be maybe. Okay, sure, sure, sure. Because I'm ordered Captain Snout. Um, a four carbon Snout. Let's see, water resistant, 250 cold. Man, you gotta make me buy this stuff, man. Jeez. Woo. Okay, we'll go somewhere else. Okay, pick, pick up all. Oh, there's some mail here. Can I open it? Should I open it? Is that a, like a? Is there a federal law here? <laughs> Am I getting in trouble for that? I wonder how many mail pieces of mail he has scattered about. I mean, let's go to him and see. He's just about one. Mm. Don't play games with me. Oh, what the heck? I feel like there's something up. They're not gonna make me wait another day to turn that shit in. Because you can complete these quests right away. I have his thing, I have that, okay. Let me see. Let's take a look at my uh, quest log. Ah, okay. The one. What? Let me see. Uh, oh, he wants one more tea pastry. Okay, I should look at the quest log first. Sorry. Um, you think I would know after after you know four days of playing this game? <laughs> I'm gonna rag on that so much because it's so silly. Uh, let's see. One more. Yeah. You know, so let's see. We need one more tea pastry. It's a quest item. Of course, the bird doesn't want it. It's a quest item. Bird knew better than I did. Then we could buy his thing. We'll get coins. It'll probably pay me back on money, right? Yeah, click all this stuff. We could sell stuff too, by the way, so it's good to click all this crap. Just looking for more things to pick up. Your pickup range is actually pretty pretty big. If you if you've played Don't Starve, Don't Starve has a pretty good pickup range too. Uh, this feels about the same. And like I said, it you know the aesthetically does not does it not look like just a happy, a hap hap happy happy. Don't starve. It's just like so bright and bubbly. No, no. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There's got to be another. I mean, come on. I'm, I'm running out of. I'm running out of island here. Come here, the letter in your oh, some money. Three coins. <laughs> Boy, I'm perplexed. You can fish, by the way. Just FYI, if you're if you're into a game that has fishing, harvest. Let's harvest this rock. Maybe there's a maybe there's a missing letter in it. Okay, well we got we got rock. <laughs> what is that? Uh, it wasn't that. Was that what fell? No, we had that. I should sell some of this crap. But we can't until we activate the store. There's a letter right there, and there's a letter over here. Bam, one, two, three. One, two, three. Mission accomplished. You see the little HUD icon shows up. It says, you could go this way. You almost can't mess this game up unless you don't read your quest log. He said, thank you, Gar, for Jeremy, a lawsuit notice for client. I bet I walked right past that dumb tea pastry. Okay, there we go. Standard stuff. I'll make sure the rest of these get to the right place. Hey, check out me once in a while in case you get anything for you. All right, yeah, thank you. And then colors everywhere. And lots of stuff. And a soul thingy. Story advanced. Are my bags full yet? Oh, I was just thinking. 
The thing about the mail delivery dymo, it never stops. You can pull a double shift, you can do your routes in a flat spread, doesn't matter. There's always more work. They say it drives some postal workers crazy, but for me, it's what I love about the job. If it didn't keep me occupied, I don't know what I'd do. I have a feeling there's some like dark, melancholy wrap up to this story. Like something about it, maybe maybe it's the don't starve feel, right? Where like I just feel like it's not gonna be all cozy. Like these are spirits, you know? Like they're they're dead. <laughs> I'm I'm just a little girl helping them like cope basically, you know? And so I, there's got to be some end to this as I continue to do more stuff. Where it turns into like a tearjerker or something. And then you're like, oh, I guess I'll have to play more tomorrow. Like it's episodic, like a TV show. Okay, what am I looking for? How much money do I have? Not a lot. Let's see. Oh, you know what? Go ahead and take care of Fl uh, Flamey right now. See, here's a log for you. His fire grows bright, and he says, I'm getting hungry for more spirit wood each time you feed me. And that spirit wood is growing harder to find. How can that be when there are still so many needy shadows hiding in Cozy Grove? I can feel at least 13 more lost souls waiting to be helped. Wait, I see someone standing in a forest. Or am I mistaken? Perhaps it's an ollie shaped tree. And that's it. Feed him more. He probably wants 20 now. Let me see. Uh, what do I do next? Uh, it says there's three logs out there. Maybe close, maybe far. Yeah, he's gonna want a lot more though. It was five the last time. Okay, we gotta keep our eye out for this tea pastry business. So this opened up over here. Uh, we got a little bit more space to uh, explore. I have noticed that there's definitely a shift in uh, the island generation. I want to say every day, uh, but I think it's every time I upgrade Flamey that I get a little bit more island. More things to go and rummage around in. And eventually you get to the point where you can just expand his light or repeat it, I guess. Or find some way to illuminate everything, everywhere. Where is this damn tea pastry? It's hard to see because it's the same damn color as the background. Oh, there's another spirit here. Who's this guy? Oh. Have we talked to this one before? They're all square. It's hard to tell. Uh, who dares? Who dares disturb the forest? Oh, this one's new. Uh, sorry, just trying to be sociable. Sociable? If you're trying to be sociable, then you must be alive. How wonderful! I thought you were just an imp. Back to torment me as usual. It's been a while since we've had a living, breathing creature in these woods. For decades, it's just been me and my fellow trees. Can they talk to you? Oh yes, they're as full of thoughts and opinions. Amerson, Carson, Cacao, Thor, Thor, Thoro, uh, say hello to our guest. They must be feeling shy. Of course, I'm a little different from your typical tree. I'm sure you'd noticed. It's my embarrassing lack of leaves. The imps plucked them off me years ago and scattered them across the island. Would you mind finding my leaves for me? Okay, now we gotta find leaves. Oh, the pile of leaves and have any leaves in it. <laughs> I mean, the tea paste you're being on the. I'm sure one of you guys seen it already. Been here the whole time. Why don't you tell me, chat? Oh, don't I have? Don't I have that thing he's looking for? Oh no, it's this one. What is this? Um. Okay. Potted plant. Okay, we're gonna take this and turn this in. After we pick this thing up. We got a rock or a potato. Here we go. Yeah, see, that's why we could do it. Yeah, see, I think I lost it yesterday, given my ghostly condition. It's hard to, for me to even be sure. Our sense of uh, the here and now is all mixed up with our memories of our past lives. Objects from the past tend to appear and disappear as we think about them. So this here, it might be my old ranger's mug. Or it might be a memory of a mug made solid by energy from the beyond. Sip. Either way, it's tea uh, is hot and tasty. 
We have another light, which means we can expand out our area a little bit further. Does that actually touch? Oh, it's so close. Oh, we gotta get that money too. Gotta get paid, gotta get paid. Scatter the money all over the damn place. Can't you just hand it to me, jerk? Just throws money everywhere. He's got something else for me, huh? Here's a log for you. Oh yes, there's a log. Delicious! Seven more logs for a fool! I sense at least two logs out there, maybe close to where you're far. See, that's how they get you. That's how they get you. Because you can only have, there's only two logs out here right now, which is two more quests to do. And then that's it. You can't progress that any further. You can't progress flaming any further. It means you cannot progress the um, the story any further to, to reveal more ghosts and everything and more chunks of land and all that. So, you know, it. I can't complain about the time gating because I, I played, I have ugh, countless hours in uh in Animal Crossing New Leaf. I have so many hours in that game. Um and it's because what I do I, I pick up the I pick up the damn game and I play it for like, you know, just like eh, play it for like 30 minutes maybe and then I go to sleep. You know, and I did that for god probably like solid 6 6 7 months something like that. It was my number one game every single night. It was my go to sleep game. Uh let's place this pot of plant. I just place everything wherever. Did she just drop it on the ground? Okay, I guess so. Um yeah, it's my number one game. Just played it for freaking months. Solid. Let me see. Page right out of her skull. Okay, good. Holding hand. Okay, the object is important to someone. May not be ready to receive it yet. Okay. Let's go and grab this and place it. Let's go up here. Try to fill in this gap. Can I repeat his light? I sure can. Sure can, actually. You know what? Let's try to go up here. Because there's something else I want you guys need to see before we... I mean, we still got some stuff to do here, but I kind of want to end the show without uh, showing you guys that some trees have fruits, and you could shake them, but not these ones. Well, I tried. Uh, the way there's a little okay. <laughs> so there are trees that uh, bear fruit that you can um, harvest, please. Uh, that you could shake and you could get fruit off of them. I have not gotten to the point where I could actually, you know, um, plant anything or anything like that. Like plant, like an actual tree that's going to grow, like in, like in a uh, uh, new leaf. Let me see, this guy wants another pastry. Let me see if he'll take it. Okay, nope. Okay, so my little area is getting pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. So the other things I need to run around and find and dig up so I can... You know, like leaves. <laughs> I check my mail if I want to, but he's got nothing for me. Pile of leaves here. Is there any leaves in this leaf pile? Nope. Lots of wood, lots of logs. Okay. Still searching. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I didn't know he's going to talk to him. This thing I can eventually... Yeah, the shrubbery. Maybe I need like a machete or something like that. I don't know if there's machete in this game that seems so violent for a game like this. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. Let me take this. Okay, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna go sell a bunch of stuff. Because these shells are worth money. We'll sell a bunch of crap. We'll buy the thing that we, the other guy needs. We'll get another soul log. Uh, was it you? No, no. Uh, gotta go to the shop. Here we go. Wait, he does not look awake, though. Here we go. I want to buy clothes. I want to sell stuff. Okay, so here's what we'll do. We're gonna select everything we want to sell. Let's see. 550. Oh, look at that. So we can sell that. Uh, four walnuts. Sure. 550 coins. A uh, small ore. I don't know if we need these things for anything, but... But whatever. Uh, 950. 50 for one turnip? Common food is common. Oh, this is total. Total selected. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's see. It is common. Uncommon. Hmm. Oh, it just sells for a little bit more, I guess. What does it sell for? The 30. Uh, some of these sell for like 100, though. Like that one. Oh, no, that was only 30 is also. Let's see, more shrooms. It's in a circle. 
can lure fairies and imps. Oh, interesting. Well, I can't really make a circle out of it. I don't have enough. Um, sweet, if it left on the ground, I have to sell it to the first frost. Yeah, I wonder if some of these things have a purpose when you just put them on the ground, you know? I've been wondering about that. But there are things that are grayed out, so I'm assuming those are things that you don't really want to sell. I'm rich. I'm just going to buy everything I need from now on. Let me see. Okay. Common. And then bagels. We'll keep the bagels. There we go. Oh, man, I'm going to be rich, dude. 5,000. Heck yeah. I probably need some of that stuff. Got an achievement for that, too. Now I want to buy clothes. Let's see. I'm going to buy that. Sounds great. Take my money. Ooh, would you like to purchase? Uh, to wear this no, 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 no. It's not for me. Okay, and then, um, I guess, sh sh uncommitted beard. Wait, what? This is, this is as much beard as you can grow without becoming the beast with no neck. That looks like a mask. <laughs> a cat mask. Okay, that might be kind of cute. Let's get that. Sounds great to get money. Yeah, put it on. Oh, it's adorable. Um, how about a Nick cat? We're going full don't starve. Yeah. <laughs> yes, of course, wear it out. Uh... It is a beard. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, that's a better cat. Man, what the heck? Oh, whatever. It's fine. Okay. Now let's go give that guy what he what he's looking for. We've dressed our character up. Here we go. The rumors are true! If that fox sells wares as fine as these, I'll permit him to haunt the dry docks for now. Yes, indeed, the chill, the chill is fading already. This is a wing warmer of the finest quality. I think I'll add it to my cabinet of the mind. What's the cabinet of the mind? Why, every explorer worth their salt has a cabinet of the mind. Though some of the less lyrical among them might call it an item collection. Squawk! It's an imaginary box I use to track the, the doodads, whelps, and golly what's I've come across on my travels. Once you have that idea, you can easily imagine an item collection of your own. Ooh, is this item collection even real? As real as you want it to be. Ah, I see it taking shape. Anything you'd like to donate? Um... Oh, what the... Oh, story advance. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then that's gonna open up. Yep. Let's, uh, let's donate. Let's split this first. Yep, we just randomly put it over here. And then, uh, we'll donate that. What a lovely small iron ore. Shall we add it to the collection? Sounds great. Here we go. I'll archive this right away. Now we have a piece of ore in our item collection. Cooking. Zero out of... Yeah, this is every... <laughs> Sardew Valley has a library. Um, uh, obviously, there's the museum in, in New Leaf. Yeah. Gotta have it, man. Gotta come back and gotta do them all. The Stardew Valley is it? No, it's not really the. It's is it the? Because I guess if we get unlocks, then it would be more like the community center in Stardew Valley, right? Not necessarily just a gathering post. If we get unlocks, that is. Like if we get a bridge built or something. Let's talk to homeboy and see what else you want. Oh boy, I was just thinking. Let's run with the old sea dogs. You might hear some tall tales from time to time. Treacherous sea monsters running a barky in two. Like it was snapping a toothpick. That sort of thing. But don't pay him no heed and listen well when I tell you where the real monsters lie. The real monsters are on the ship. Dang. Okay. Uh, I want to donate. I want to check my collections. Uncollected rewards. Hey. So I do have a reward here. Get a present. All right. So that means it's like the community center in Stardew Valley. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Let's get over here and let's open our present away from everybody. Is this it? The scout pages? Or was it this? Oh, it's probably this. 12 quartz mile. Wow. Okay. Material, valuable, gem. We can make more money that way. I guess we'll just hold on to it for now. Uh, This is my crafting guy here. Oh, there's a leaf right here. Let me grab that leaf. Two out of five. Two out of five leaves. Did I sell a leaf on accident? No, I picked up more than that. Okay, let me see. I want to craft something. And then we're getting out of here. We're done. We're done for the day. I can finish this up later. Uh, I say I need one more softwood, but I can make a softwood, can't I? Yes, I can. I'll make a softwood out of this. So it sounds great. Here are the materials. This is about as annoying as uh, 
as new leaf, by the way. Crafted, yay! Okay, I want to make one more thing. Go back to the menu. I want to craft something. Something like you want to craft. <laughs> and not quite as tedious. Like, they def man, new leaf definitely holds the, 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 the championship belt for just the most annoying crafting system in the world. Um, see, that sounds great. Here are the materials. But this is, this is, uh, a worthy, <laughs> a worthy homage to that. So we can go and place this light. What's other stuff we can craft? Let's go take a look. I want to craft something. I want to craft a gold bar. Ooh, I want to craft a, ooh, a gem. Let's craft that. Yeah, it sounds great. 10 quartz gemstones. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. We're crafted. Yay. Artisan. I'm an artisan now. Let me see. I can make another chair. I mean, it's kind of pointless to make some of this stuff because I have nowhere to put it. There doesn't seem to be any house or anything that I can decorate. I have a tent that's constantly deflated. Um, so yeah, it's always it's always just on the ground. Never, never actively like uh, uh, accessible or anything like that. So I'd imagine that everything and all the materials you get for stuff is all outdoor material, right? Wicker, wicker uh, table. Um, uh, you know, the the uh, barrel, the wooden benches, like, these are all outdoor things. So, I haven't come across anything that's crafting indoors. So, let's go ahead and place this, um, where do I want to put it? This thing's new, I think. And we got another walnut. Yeah, let's go place this guy. This guy usually lights things up. I wonder what his problem is. I mean, he looks happy as hell. We'll place this here. Yeah, he don't care. He's like, whatever. He's chill. <laughs> is his shop open? His shop is not open. I think I have to do something for him. So yeah, I guess I got one more, one more thing to do. Oh, yo, down for the fishing. That's right. That's a big boy. Oh my gosh, we guys the fishing. And then we're done. Holding hand. Okay, here we go. Okay. Right trigger. Aim. Right about there. Bam! Come on, big boy. It's just like, it's just like New Leaf. You wait for them to grab, and then... You hit A to reel in. And you don't have to like mash it or anything like that. You just gotta hit it once. As soon as he pulls it under. Come on, baby. Boom! Gotcha! What is this? Shadow Mouth! Hey, alright. Let's grab this other one while we're here. That one's far. Here we go. So, Cozy Grove, man, it's a tough one. You know, it's $14.99, so it's reasonably priced for what it is. Uh, a, you know, periodic, <laughs> uh, uh, what do you call it? What is the style of game called again? Like, <laughs> it's not a survival. It's, uh, it's just a game you play periodically, right? It's a time killer. It's, it's, it's a relaxing, laid back, whatever. I don't know. Um, but there's, there is progression. It is very slow. It says there's 40 hours of content. Um, God, my aim is just whack. What the hell? Uh, the gating can be frustrating for sure because it's like if you had like like yesterday I had one more soul log uh, in order to progress the story and I couldn't do it because the uh, uh, we ran out on the island so I was like great and now there's seven to do which there's only two more so I'll find one more and I probably will have to wait another day after this uh, in order to progress the story even further so if you're like if you're trying to race through the story then you're gonna have a bad time if you're like chill with just, you know what, I'm just gonna play the game a little bit every day, run around, collect stuff, collect materials, do some crafting, make some stuff, make a cozy little bench, extend the light out a little bit, make a little nice, you know, nice little work area. I mean, I just kind of threw everything on the ground, right? But you can make this look nice. You can make this look nice. Uh, it's a shame we couldn't find any trees with fruits on them, unless I just wasn't paying attention and ran run by one like 15 times, which is not unheard of. Looks just like this, but with fruits. Um, but yeah, it's it's definitely a game for a niche a niche uh, audience for sure. You know, niche like um, like Animal Crossing's millions and millions and millions of purchasers, right? <laughs> uh, oh, another walnut here. Boop. There we go. But I think we're good. That's Cozy Grove available right now for fourteen ninety nine. Uh oh, it's got a bone in it. No, it doesn't. That was just that's just a thing. On Steam. A cute, a cute little. The bright side of Don't Starve. <laughs> the night does not kill you. <laughs> My name is Mike B. A. K. Phony. Hope you guys have a good one. I'll see you.